What's up? Sway. Finesse Lifestyle. Come along with the journey, man. Let me cut off. My life is a moving. And everyone's watching. Hey, to start off, I just want to say there's a lot of people in the pickup community and in the pickup arts to have a lot of different theories about approaching Zach and approaching somebody that you don't know. You have to look at it like, don't take it as a big deal. When you're approaching girls, it's not a big deal. You have to go at it like you're having fun. It's a process and you're offering value. When you, you're meeting a stranger, you're offering value to another human being. Approaching somebody new is a nerve-wracking thing. It's not normal. Most people, when they meet somebody new, they meet people through a social circle, or they meet somebody new through another friend, or family, or work. So meeting people new is a nerve-wracking thing. I get that, I understand it. The biggest pickup artists in the world have approach anxiety, but the main thing is they don't let it prevent them from going out and practicing their when approaching, you always gotta apply the three second rule. The three second rule. When you see a girl that you wanna approach, you got three seconds to approach her. That prevents approach anxiety from kicking in. That prevents you from getting inside your head and giving yourself excuses on why you shouldn't go up and start talking to her. Three second rule, man. Remember that, apply it, and it'll boost your results. Take this for an example. A lot of people say that you should want to have confidence. If only I had confidence, I'd be able to go out and practice my art and approach if I had confidence. But that's something that I don't look for. I'd rather have competence. Competence. Just say you're in an airplane and you're about to get ready to jump out of an airplane. Which would you rather have, confidence or competence? If you jump out that airplane, you don't want to get all riled up and not pull that ripcord, right? In that situation, you would rather have competence, which is a healthy fear, which is the same thing when you're approaching. You want to have a healthy fear, right? You're approaching a woman, man, child, old person, cat, dog, right? You're doing it, you're doing that approach to build the skill set so when a woman of particular beauty and value come along, you'll have the right skill set to attract her, build comfort, and ultimately seduce her.